Looks like they're going to get in again. Oh, good. Who? At local council elections next Thursday. Oh, right. Looks like they're going to get 42% of the vote. How do you know? Well, it says so down here. They've been around asking people. They've been having an opinion poll, asking people how they're going to vote. 42 out of every hundred say they're going to vote Conservative, only 39 Labour, and 40... Here, look, there's the figures. Well, nobody asked me how I'd vote. Well, they can't ask everybody, can they? Take too long. They simply go round, they say, now, would you... Or, uh, uh, you know, well, what would you have told them? To get stuff. Oh, that's very nice, and that's very, very helpful. It's time you took more interest in politics. No. I mean, don't you want to make this world a better place? Well, of course I do. I support the number one Democratic Party. Number one? What's that in aid of? In aid of number, number one. one. Yes, I might have known. Well, look, it's time we were going to the Crown. Is it? Oh. Here. Here, where's my money? Money? Oh, yeah, yeah. Hang on. What's that? 50p. We made 72 quid on that last job. Less 21 pound for materials. Oh, one of them 72 is 71. Uh, 20 of them 71 is 51 pound. 51 pound. Less 28 pound for TV, electricity, yeah, all gas. Yeah, right, all right. 28 and 51. Uh, 20 and 51 is 31. 8 from 31 is... 23. 23 pound. Less 12 pound for shopping. That leaves 11 pound. Your share, five pound fifty. Oh, I pay up then. You know, that's it. You got it. That's only fifty pence. You asked me to put aside five pound each week for the eight speed on your motorbike. <sighs> Which reminds me, when are you going to get that silence fixed? Etty keeps yeah, on all, all the time. Yeah, all right. more jobs coming in. Nah, nobody wants any decorating done just now. I'll put an advert in the paper. I hope I get some replies. Yeah, I can't go in a match with fifty pence. I'll tell you all about it. When I'll get back. Hey, where can you afford it? Because some of us don't waste our money gallivanting about on motorbikes. I wanna go get a job of my own. Favourites to win the World Cup in 1982. We asked some of the fans here what they thought. 31% said West Germany, 26% said Brazil, 19% said England. Oh, oh, shut up. Said... oh, hello. Good afternoon. Sorry to bother you. Do you have an elderly person living here? Elderly? Oh, you mean my granddad? Oh, he's very old. In that case, could I speak to him? Well, not just now. He's out. Ah. Well, perhaps I'll call back later. No, no, don't go. Uh, he'll be back soon. Any minute now. Um, why don't you come inside, sit down, put your feet up? Well, if you're sure he won't be very long. My name is Anne Silver. I'm oh, nice to meet you. My name's Mike. Oh, hello. As I was saying, I work for National Surveys Limited. Come again? It's a firm that undertakes market research. Opinion polls, that sort of thing. Oh, you want to know which way we'll vote? I've given it some thought. Oh, no, 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 this is nothing to do with the election. Uh, this survey's for the Borough Council. It's about old people. Oh, I see. <laughs> well, perhaps there's a few things you could tell me while we're waiting. Oh, sure, ask me anything. Only too glad to help. So, come inside, I'll make you a cup of tea. Oh, really? No, there's no, no, no to... my pleasure. Oh, thank you very much. Sit yourself down. Oh, thank you. Oh, oh. Your grandfather isn't bedridden, then. He can get around. Oh, well, just about. I expect he's taking a nap in the Garden of Rest. He likes a bit of peace and quiet. <laughs> What's it all about, this survey thing? Well, as you know, the council provides services for old people and they want to find out if the services are working properly or if there's a need for more. Well, what kind of services? Well, homes and houses, cheap transport, day centres. For instance, does your grandfather have meals on wheels? No, he has them sitting right here. <laughs> no, I mean, does he have a hot meal brought to him every day? Oh, only if I bring it. He's much too lazy to... Well, that is, he can't get as far as the cooker. So you have to look after him? Oh, yeah. He's helpless on his own. I see. That's well, quite a responsibility at your age. Oh, well, that's me. Thoughtful, considerate, lovable. <coughs> <coughs> so you really 
are the wage earner. Oh, yeah. Well, that is, I'm not actually earning a wage at the moment. I'm out of work. Oh, I'm sorry. It sounds as if you really do need help. Were you thinking that... No, I wasn't. Look, I'm only here to fill out the questionnaire. Sorry. I told you. That's what the survey's for. To find out where help is needed. How do you do that? Well, like I am now, of course. We go round to people's houses and we fill out these forms. And then when we've got the answers, we can work out the facts and figures. Facts and figures? Statistics. Oh, well, I get it. Like, 10,000 people voted and 2,000 are up the poll and... Yeah, that sort of thing. See, you must have facts and figures so that people can decide what to do. How to help. But well, why do they want to help? Why? Well, because... Well, it's a matter of social conscience, isn't it? Aren't you concerned about your grandfather? Oh, of course I am. He worries me stiff, he does. Poor old thing. Hi. Oh. Oh, that's him. We won. One nil, smashing game. Um, he's listening to the radio. Oh. Jenkins scored in the last minute. Oh, lovely, Edda. Doesn't sound very helpless. Uh, no, he doesn't. Um, wait here. He got this part. Hey, Bobby, what, what do you mind getting the supper tonight? Supper? Yeah, and while it's cooking, you can get the vacuum out. Vacuum? Yeah, and go around the house. Yeah. <coughs> well, I've <coughs> got this nasty turn come on again. <coughs> I, I like the world, but I, I think I'd better go and have, have a lay down. You don't mind, do you? <laughs> uh, no, of course I don't mind. You, you lie down as long as you like. Leave it all up to me. Hey, what's come over you? Supper, vacuum. Oh. <coughs> there, look, see what I mean? It must be very hard for you. Uh, may I speak to him now? Oh, no, no not just now. Uh, the excitement would be too much for him. Oh. Better let him rest. Well, I'll call another time. Perhaps I can help. You need a job, don't you? Well, if it pays well enough. That is, uh, if it's something worthwhile. Well, the firm needs a clerk to help with accounting. The firm? Where you work? Yes. Oh, I'll take it. Are you good at maths? Maths? Me? <laughs> Call there on Monday at 9.30. Ask for Mr Medway. I'll be there too. Grandad! Yes, Michael? You can get the supper now. How many steps and stairs are there in your own? Do you have difficulty going up and down? No difficulty, a bit of a strain. What do you mean I can get the supper? I thought you no, said... I'm, I'm busy now, aren't I? Busy doing what? What's that? It's something I'm taking up. National Survey Limited? Yeah, it's a firm that does market research. What's that? Finding out what people do or what they like or whatever. You know, 10% of girls over 15 wear pink knickers, that sort of stuff. This one's about old people. Old people? Don't look at me. Since when have you been concerned about old people? I want to make the world a better place tonight. I have got a social conscience. Yeah, like I've got two heads. How much are you getting paid? I'll find out on Monday. Are you satisfied with the services the council provides? Well, satisfied. Fairly satisfied, dissatisfied, very dissatisfied. Well, that's asking them, isn't it? What do they want to know all that for? Well, you've got to have the facts and figures if you want something done. Oh, is that so? It, well, tell me, is it fair that 50% of the people should do all the work while the other 50% sit on their backside and do nothing? Well, of course it ain't fair. Right, well, you can help me get the supper. <laughs> 